today we are going to be talking about the Dragriffle. There are nine different colors you can see over here. All right, let me just go through probably bit by bit. So these are all actually matching with most of the books that's yes. available in the Loystrom series. Later we're going to match it, right? Later we're going to match it, yeah, for sure. One on top you can see is... Which one? Do you remember? This is a sage. You don't know what it is. You don't know? You don't know. <laughs> so those who are into cooking, you all know what sage is. So this is the color of the sage. So actually, it comes with a matching notebook. So you can, you guys see the pen together with the book. All right. Yeah. So Sage, this is one of the most popular new colors. If you haven't got a copy of the notebook, this is a muted color series that was launched earlier part of the year. And now they came out with the pen. I think you can see very clearly all the colors later on. We just see, show you one of the matching ones first. Then the only one that has no matching book is the white color. Because we don't have any white. Yeah, there's no white notebooks. Once upon a time there was. Really? So yeah, now there isn't any more. So this is the white color. So it has actually got six sides. It's a hexagonal pen. Why is it called the Dragriffle? I don't know. Dragriffle is two parts. So Dre, this portion, D-R-E-H, is actually twist. Twist. Oh, it, it, so obviously this pen must be able to twist in some way. Twist to open. Cool, yeah. So what Erin was just saying, it twists to open. So yeah, this twist. twist the top. Yeah. So yeah, this part so is once a twist. You twist it, it will open like that. Come, let me you show the bigger screen then so that we can see. You. Okay, cool. So, so I'll show on the small screen and she'll show on the big screen. So, so Dre is twist, twist and Griffo is actually meaning stylus. Stylus, all right. So twist this, stylus. yeah, twist stylus. So apparently this design came out back in the 1920s. So there's a bit of history in this. So they brought it back to life. All right. So some of you might know that um, Leuchtturm was born in 1917. Okay. So this is number one. So we are quite excited because number one means there'll be more than one pen coming out from the company. Oh. Okay. Um, this is made with brass and aluminium inside so it's pretty lightweight and this you can see the brass tips okay so when i twist it open so you can see it move all right so it's actually you can hear or see that it's actually spring loaded so it bounces off quite nicely all right and you can just do so lightly yeah, you can hear the click sound. So it's twist and it's spring assisted. So it's quite a simple pen. So it's 14 grams. So you can feel it's pretty light. All right. So there are quite a few colors to choose from. You take out all the colors. Okay. I have, you know the, I other have colors. the sage white yellow. You're going to show it on this screen or the other screen? Um, this way. Huh? Mm. Yeah. Is it easier to show on this a bigger screen or smaller screen? Okay. This one looks very nice. White. Oh, yellow. This yellow is called, it's a lemon yellow. Banana. You didn't no. show you the logo. It's not banana color, it's a lemon color. Banana. Yeah. Alright, this is the yellow color. Then this one? No, I don't know. This blue has got a special yeah. name. It matches the book. It's called denim. Denim. Then yep, then denim. Pen. Then later we'll show all the matching one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then this one. Yes. This one. This Bellini. peach color they call it Bellini. Bellini, Bellini. Yeah. Is it clear enough, or maybe we use the other one? Yeah. Let's use the other one. Mm. Yeah, the camera is here. Mm. Yeah, slowly. Okay. Mm. Oops. <laughs> so. This and is the Bellini. We also have red. 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 
Show the logo. Okay, flip it around slowly. The other way, yep. Very good. So you can see this is the red. Very high contrast with the white trims. So it's pretty nice. So the white is a bit of a off white. Okay, then there's this one. This is. It's just um. Uh, what kind of pink is this? Show, show the light pink. It's a light pink. It's called the powder. Powder. <laughs> powder. Powder's not like that. Powder pink. <laughs> this is how they like to name the pink color. That's powder pink. And get some water. Mm, yeah. Okay, then one of the very popular colors in the Lorstam Notebook series. Mm, okay, you don't move too much, just be mm. careful. Everybody can hit it. I keep on moving. That's why. So this one is in Nordic blue. We have to put that inside yet. We have to make sure the books. Yeah, so this is Nordic blue. So all of the mechanisms work the same. So this is in Nordic blue. See, and books then, are going to disappear. This is the matte black. Uh, so normally, people will use the book without the, the sleeves. No. It will topple over at some point in time, but you can see. Okay. So how does it look like? Because when you're actually using the book, you would of course take out the sleeve. sleeve. Right? So this is our Ooh, limited edition cool. journey it's festival. Limited edition, it says. Yeah. Journey For those of you who festival. come to our journey festival. 2018. Yeah, so this is a 2018 one. So Very nice. So these are the rates. Still slightly different. But it's the, based on the same pantone. But of course, because it's on different material, it looks slightly different. Yeah. Slightly dark. Yeah, then there's a bit of shadow coming out from the camera as well. Okay. So that's the red. Then we move on to the yellow. Eric can take out and show the yellow. Yellow. It's actually kind of. Yeah, it looks the same. Yeah, it looks the same. It matches. Matches the most. Okay. Matches the most. Matches the most. Yeah. So, there's something we wanted to show you guys as well because other than the matching booklet, it actually has matching pen loops as well. So, those of you who are familiar with Leuchtturm notebooks, you will know that they have pen loops so this yes. will allow you to keep the pens together so you can attach the pen loops to the back of like the book so you can put together you can... so i can show you based on my book so this is my journal um, and then <laughs> and then oh, i've got a matching pen loop on the inside and then you can oh, attach it in very easily Oh, ah. oh, so this one's already so stick forever. Yeah, mm. so the panel is already here. Yeah, once you stick it on, it's there. It's a permanent one, so that it doesn't drop off. And so this pen slides in pretty easily. See, yeah. you can also just do it like that. Okay, just for sure. Okay, just for sure. I'm not. Gonna show? I'm not gonna even. I'm not gonna actually even like take it out. It's not supposed yeah. to be like that. Yes. Like that. Yeah. So can you show under the camera? Yeah, so you can just slot it in. So red is matching here. So these are the pen loops. Yeah. So some people like to do it as a matching color or you can do it as a contrast color. So if you like red together to go with a yellow with a red pen loop, can you see? So it's pretty cool, right? Then you can use it. So that's purely personal. The invisible hand insists that blue is nicer. So you can get it blue as well. Yeah instead right so one. it's up to you so you everybody's taste you have to take one two three four five six <laughs> one, two, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just That's an idea too. You can do whatever you want with it, kind of thing. Or you do one, two. Does it does it sound so practical? But uh, or you do you never two. Know. Or you do two extra secure. Extra secure. Yeah, this is also possible. Extra secure. Oh yeah. You can do extra secure. So you can see here we have the pen loops available in all the different Except colors. Except white again. Except white again. So these are the new muted colors. The four muted colors which is the powder pink, the bellini, the denim, and the bellini. sage. And the more usual colors, which is the red, yellow, nordic blue, and black. That's also available. All right. So let's get back to the pen. So this, uh, you can tell now, it's all the matching books available. OK, so let me move on quickly. For those who haven't seen the other matching books, of course, there's a uh, long or short up to you okay so there's a black book this is the nordic blue book in the middle and then this yeah this one's different because this is a new sample that we just received so those of you who are into sketching can let us know if you think this is something that you like yeah so it's 150 gsm but it's uh, quite interesting because this is a sketchbook that apparently takes watercolor really? well as mm. well yeah so this is a new paper that they've developed which is different from their previous sketchbook the previous sketchbook was 180 gsm but um, this is actually lighter but the paper quality has actually improved so yeah so then it comes in a different format this is in a yeah, landscape format I'm the pens when brand new they comes in this triangular box and it shows the numbers so let me show you ha 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 it vanished the pens vanished yep so you can see so this is number one in black so then you have the different descriptions okay, this is black yep. this is the black oh, careful careful slowly so you can see it's a triangular shape packaging. <laughs> Don't fight my pen. Okay, okay. You'll get a headache watching it. So you can see the red color, the powder color. All right. So at the side, you can see as well. All right. The pens, you can see it's made in Taiwan, actually. So you can see powder. It shows that it's a ballpoint pen. Okay. Yeah, you can see the color of the pen, the drag ripple, packaging is all inside there. So if you may open up, okay, so there's a sticker, little sticker here for you to open up. Open up, then it will become... <laughs> <laughs> so I will unveil it slowly. So you can see over here there's as well. A, there's two pens inside. Yeah. So don't confuse them. There's not two pens inside. There's only one pen. Inside. You can see the the instruction booklet inside here. You can see. Don't read it. It talks about Hoistum is reviving the drag ripple from the 1920s and a little bit about the history. All right. The ballpoint pen. The standard inside is actually royal blue. It's actually royal blue. All right. Then explanation in English and in German. Behind it's fully German and it shows a uh, twisting action. So the pen is this way. All right, this is facing front. So it's this direction. This direction is following the clock. clock. <laughs> <laughs> so this is following the clock. So it is clockwise direction to open up and anti-clockwise to close it all right so very easy pen clockwise then anti-clockwise to close Where did all right the go? so when you want to switch the Where did the tape go? here the paper is here is this the original pen i want to use the original because we want to show what's inside and how the ink like so the original is blue so because wait why is blue yeah so the one that i have oh, is yeah. not in blue how so how come? Because mine is a sample. But this is also in blue. So when you buy brand new is blue, so it's a blue medium, but you can see it's 
beautiful to write with. So it's blue standard. Why? Because apparently in Germany, that's always the standard that the primary schools, elementary schools, they are using is always in blue. Which is why if you, if you buy another brand, some of the German brands, for example, the Kawiko, the blue is a standard in cartridge as well. Show the color. Right? So you can see the color of the ink. <laughs> so really this is a light 15 grams. Yep, you can write your name. What color is yours? So, okay, then you can see my face. So, this is a light 15 grams. And now we want to be able to see what's underneath. You want to try so when I open, you also open as well at the same time. You want to open one? So, we want to see how to change the refills. Alright. So, when you change the refill, you can just twist open in the anti clockwise direction after it's closed. So you continue to twist open, then you can drop it out. So be careful because there's actually a spring here. All right, don't lose this spring when you're changing your refuse. And so this is a very standard, what we call a G2. Or G2, you cannot remember, it's too difficult to remember a name called G2. People mostly know what's a Parker pen because they were the, all, all those original pens that make this famous so this is quite often also called a Parker Refill so most bookshops there would sell it so you can see here it says G2 I don't know whether you can see clearly um, can focus it's a bit bright here but you can see actually it says Leuchtturm something something ISO and it ends with the word G2 all right, oh, and it says made in Germany, so this refill is yeah. from Germany as well, and it's a uh, flow blue. All right, so um, the refills are not available in Singapore yet. They are gonna come in in October, so they'll be available no, in blue, and soon they'll be available in black as well. All right, and. From our sources, we understand that they'll be coming out with a gel version, but we don't know when that's going to come in for those of us who are very used to using gels. We want to have a gel. Yep. So, but those who cannot wait and wants to have a black refill immediately, we, at City Lux, we actually carry Parker replacement refills in this size, the G2 refill in different colors, in many different colors and different size. We, count, we have them from Montevideo, we have them from Kawiko as well. Kawiko has them in black gel as well. So if you really love your gels, you can use those immediately. Yeah, so you just buy this and then you can switch. The Kawiko G2 gel is very, very nice and smooth to use. So when you put it back in, clockwise direction, tighten it, all right? then you are good to go. So you can see, all right, back to this. Cool. So what's your favorite color so far? Maybe you all can comment out of all these colors that we have already displayed. Out here, what is your favorite color? Let me know. What's your favorite color? So we actually have the tester here. Okay, you can see. Okay, it says Dragrifo. This is not a pen because this is the slogan. Yeah, be careful, don't knock it together. Then you can see they've actually worn the red dot design. So red dot design is really an international price that every product designer wish that they had. Alright, then you can see we have a testing pad and all the colors are available here. Cool. So you guys can come down to the Cilux workroom and try it out. Test out the pen for yourself, okay? Then apparently they have just also won the Good Design Award, which is actually a German award for good design. So that's for 2021. So the offer going on now because it's brand new is that you can buy any of it and we will be offering a caramel jot book. Caramel. Yeah, it comes in squares on the inside. This is worth $26.50.
So oh, you oh, get oh, free oh. now with any Dragrifo pen that you buy right now. Put it a bit lower. Yeah. Okay. So it's a slim, oh. um, soft cover so book with um, 60 pages inside. Flexible. And we're having promotion now as well is the engraving service normally individual name engraving is fifteen dollars now it's only five dollars five dollars yeah it's only five dollars so this will only be here till when two weeks it's for two weeks so that's until next week I think that's until next week. Um, I think we just, wait. We just started a promo or oh, just started a promotion yesterday. So that's two weeks from today it should end. Yep. So grab your drag rifle, get a free notebook. How much is a drag rifle actually currently? It's um forty five dollars. Okay. <laughs> yeah, five dollars for personalization. So if you can go inside, I think we're gonna put the link for the drag rifle as well. Then you can look at the prices there. Nine colors to choose from. Thank you, everyone.